All right, game two. We're going up against a platinum this time. This time we have a platinum. So let's see how this one goes. So what I want to try to see is the difference between... A, sorry, this is a diamond, sorry, not a platinum. I want to see a difference between a diamond and a crimson, okay? So let's see how we go through these gunfights. So right now he's playing patient on the... Okay, we can't use the equipment, by the way, bro. So yeah, so so far it's been a good start. And I think... Let's see the difference. So last game was a crimson. I just want to see kind of how these guys play differently and uh, what mechanics they use. Okay, I am one shot. So right now I'm expecting him to be a bit more aggressive off the break. But he's, is he going to be aggressive? Yeah, he is. Which is good. Going to back off. I'm going to let him play to his aggression and push, let him push me. My goal is to push me here. So right now, I want them to be a bit more aggressive, which is good for me. Because I'm basically able to use their aggression to my advantage. So I'm going to sit back on this head glitch. And you can see what I mean. Like, a lot of players in the lower, not low levels, but a little bit lower than, like, kind of crimson and stuff, they decide to, they play very aggressive certain times. Like, right now, this is where he should be a bit more aggressive when I'm one shot. Do you see what happens when he, like, kind of takes his time? It allows me to the regen, and then I'm the one who's played the aggression. So I'm letting him go free slide across. Again, using your mechanics to your advantage. So, so far, it's going well. It's going well, this little tutorial. <laughs> so let's back off, play my life. Let him be a bit more aggressive, which he's doing. He's basically playing into my game. You see, he's, he's not very patient. So he's going to go through. And now I'm going to pounce. And as soon as I pounce, he thinks, I think he's going to stay. There you go. So as you play aggressive, I feel like he's like, right, I'm a bit scared now. I'm going to play passive and it works to my advantage every time. So let's back off now. Okay, let's go through. Again, I'm just going to play aggressive here. I don't mind. So, so far, so good. How are we going to approach this next time fight? I'm absolutely one shot. So right now, we're literally just going to chill back here and not move. And it's just about mixing up between your pacing. I, I didn't need to do that, did I? I'm, I'm sorry, Terra. I didn't mean to do that. Yo, my controller slipped, bro. All right, let's, ch let's chill here. Let him push me again. Let him push me. No, I trolled. I trolled. But again, you're using the aggression to your advantage. There were some good shots there with the SMG. Going to push through the middle. And again, pre-fire. As soon as he spawns, we're going to pounce. Now I'm one shot. Let's, okay, what I want to do is I actually want to camera him here. So I want him to push me. And I want to camera him. So wherever he goes, whenever he comes close, I'm going to slide past him, okay? Right, so right now, he's not coming close, which is fine. What we're going to do is center onto him. Right there, literally, I knew he was on the head glitch, so we sent it onto him, released it, and got the shots off. So let's take our time, jump over his head as soon as he pushes me. I mean, it's working really well right now, this tutorial, so I'm happy with this one so far. Prone double jump. Okay, he should be spawned on my left. Right now, he's going to... Okay, now he's going to be sitting on the head glitch. This is what I wanted to see him do earlier. Let's see how we approach this now. So because we made him a bit weak now, he's going to be a bit hesitant to push me. So we're going to go through again. Again, just like that, mixing up the angles and really using your aggression to your advantage. All right, well, absolutely one shot. Let's back off now. I mean, to be fair to him, he's on obviously high ping. He isn't from America, so this isn't the most fair, I'll be honest. Should we get a shot like that? Oh, I, I trolled right there. I didn't mean to do that. So I wanted to dolphin have out of cover. Again, make them weak. Go through. Slide around the corner. Let's do the prone double jump. Let him push me. Okay, where's he going to be? Just use a cover to your advantage. So far, so good, man. It's definitely going the way we wanted it to. Oh, that's a good re-challenge from him, to be fair. All right, let's back off here. Let's back off. I'm going to let him push me, and I'm going to jump at him. <laughs> he almost fried me there. All right, let me back play my life here. Right, how are we going to go this? Right, what I want to do is I want to go for the knife. You just as cover. Just bait him in with some shots. 
You can just bait him in like that. Oh, no. Okay, good jump from him. I tried to bait him in there. There you go. So when they get too close like that, you can use that to your advantage. Slide across. As you slide, just back off. Jump through backwards. Same thing here. Perfect. So literally use your mini-map. Play it to your advantage. Now he's going to be scared of the jump. Okay, maybe not. He didn't learn his mistake. Let's see if he's learned his mistake last time. Let's see if he's learned. I think he's learned yet. Good shots there. We made him one shot. As soon as we make him one shot, we can actually push him right now. There you go. GG's. All right, GG Flame Terror, bro. So right there, that's just, I know that's kind of cheesy. It's because of the spawns. You know exactly where they're going to spawn. All right, so far, so good. We get the second kill. Let him push me. Okay, so right now I'm just playing very aggressive, pushing through. Let's slide across here. So when you slide, you kind of want to use a hip fire mechanic just to help you out a little bit more. And right now he's checked out. Like this guy is actually checked right now. The game just started 4-0. He's like, he's checked. So you want to kind of play aggressive. He's going to play very passive here. Again, right there, play to the aggression. Like, you kind of just want to play towards your opponent. So right there, I knew he was going to play a bit more uh, kind of passive. So I let him take his time, and then I kind of just went for him. Right there, again, center your aim onto the kind of crosshair with the uh, with the mini-map, and just easy shots. Back off again. I only have an AR here. So the best thing for me to do isn't to have, like, a close-range gunfight. I want to kind of keep the distance. Okay, so far, so good. This is his weapon right now, so he's definitely checked. Oh, okay, yeah. So that was a bit of a uh, mixy gunfight for me. But let's uh, back off, see what we could do here. So. Four shots. They were just bad shots for me. You kind of want to center on a lot better there. Let's see what we could do. Right there. Again, headshots. All right. So far, so good. How are we going to approach this one? I want to jump across and shoot. So basically, what I want to do is as he pushes me, I want to jump across. There you go. Especially with the veil, I feel like you just move so much quicker. Headshot, that was kind of cheesy. That was literally perfect. So as soon as I got that first shot, I was like, right, he's going to be one shot. Oh, okay. I kind of went all over the place there. Let's wait for him again. Okay, well, as soon as I challenge, I'm going to jump around the corner, right? Again, just kind of using these mechanics I've been going through, man. The short jump, the long jump, pre fire. I know it's a bit different than an on uh, online game, just because obviously it's a 1v1, you've got radar, but it's good to practice mechanics. So right now, again, let's work on our centering. Uh, because we're one shot, let's just let him push me here. Let him be aggressive. He's, like, going to be annoyed right now. He wants to push me. Okay, this is obviously not a good gunfight. So as soon as I've got a bit of health, I'm just going to get out of here. There you go. So now you can just change the whole angle, reposition. And then what you can do is play a bit aggressive, but in a different area. So. so you see how the whole gunfight switched right there? Like, although he had the advantage, I was able to disengage and get the kill right there. Okay, nice kill from him. Same scenario. He's on a head glitch. That was just some good shots there. pre fired the head glitch where I knew it was going to be. I don't really want to go through that side. I am weak a bit. Okay, let's let him push me, okay? He's, he's quite an aggressive player. And I'm just going to kind of use these little... Yeah, let's just let it come towards me. I'm looking at the minimap, right? I'm trying to see when he's in the open so I can pounce. And then I'm just going to push through. Try something different. Yeah, I'm absolute here. Okay, he knifed me. Fair play to him. That was good shots. Good knife from him. I didn't really expect that. <laughs> Alright, let's back up into cover. 
There you go. That was good because I just basically used his aggression to my advantage. Oh, okay. You see right there? He literally jumped over my screen. Oh, that was nice from him. Okay, good shots from him. He's challenging a lot though. So I'm going to use that to my advantage here. That was not a gunfight I really wanted to have because this Heglitch here is nowhere near as good as his one. So I was kind of chalked there, but somehow we managed to make it work. I meant to slide. Oh, that's all right. We'll move. We'll move on. I mean, that was just some nice shots there. I can't lie. I can't lie. That was just some good shots. Again, we don't. We want to get out of this. We don't want to fight this guy. Not, not right there. That's not a gunfight we want, so... See, again, I baited him in. As soon as he pushed me, I was able to do the prone double jump. Just because it's such a good mechanic. Right now, I'm going to wait for a second. Let him get out into the open. Then we'll, we'll challenge him. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> that was some nice shots for him. Made him one shot. All right, 20 to 9. So we want to go for a little challenge. What I want to do is I remember when I was on that side, the hardest gunfight was right here against these little... So we're just going to keep on peppering and making it weak. Yeah, that was a difficult gunfight, man. That Heglitch is so broken. Headshots. Headshots are always going to help you out. Pre-fire. All right, we are one shot, so we don't really want to engage right now. Let's back off. By the way, this is a Crimson player, okay? So he's not played in a bit, but he was a Crimson player. So you can tell it's obviously a good player we're playing against. Really good pre-fire there. We get kind of fortunate. All right, let's wait for a second. Nice, nice shots from him. Good slide across. So you see how useful sliding can be if you actually use it properly? Yo, I, I don't think there was any chance I was winning a gunfight like from that. I don't even know why I went for that. <sighs> Eggs on one right now, man. Back off, use our height to our advantage. And as soon as he pushes through, we'll jump over him. So now we're in a good position. No, I should have won that gunfight, man. Okay, it's fine. Yeah, he was he was very very aggressive again. Like I don't think he should have played that aggressive there, but fair play to him. Let's back off. Let's really go for our shot here. I do not have any ammo in this situation, so I'm gonna be kind of cheesy here. I'm actually gonna try killing myself. Oh, I got lucky. I got ammo. I got so lucky that I actually got ammo there. 26 to 14. So, so far, it's actually going well. So, right, let's back off. All right, he's on a nasty head glitch. Again, disengage, get into a better angle. All right, we made him a little bit weak here. Okay, what we want to do is get him weak and then challenge him. As soon as we get him weak, we should push through. Yeah, it was such a, such a hard gunfight. <laughs> that gunfight is basically impossible to win from either side. It's just, yeah, it's just one of those. All right, we're going to take our time. I am weak right now. But instead of going through the left, I want to try to go through a different angle here. He pushes through. So he actually did the long jump there, which is not good in that scenario. But let me back off. I'm one shot right now. So let me take my time here. shots from him man good shots let's wait for him to be aggressive we win that gunfight difficult one i'm one shot again all right we're peppering him right now which is good let's challenge let's go for it there you go difficult gunfight at the end man but we made it work we made it work we went for the reach out i don't think he expected that reach out to be honest but yeah we made it work